yo, <clears throat> yo, yo, what up, it's JSF, and we gotta talk, man, we gotta talk, it's probably be a short video, but it's something I wanna talk about, and I gotta show y'all a set in order to illustrate it to you, the point is not to air out the person I'm playing against, even though he's on Wi-Fi, I'm not here to talk shit about him, it's just something that's in the game that's inexcusable, it's proof that Netherrealm didn't test this game enough, if at all, and just that they're not learning from the mistakes of their past it's kind of just at this point bro the game's been out over a month and it's just sad bro it's just like it, it's disappointing it's annoying but it's just like it's frustrating as a consumer as somebody who paid money for this product that stuff like this is still a thing so i gotta show you all this set it looks relatively normal like i'm getting smoked right but i always get smoked in the first round then you start to see some things if you're paying close attention you might have already noticed right <clears throat> and me being me always given the benefit of the doubt as I'm playing this I'm new to playing Raiden right um not my character not who I started off with nothing like that so I'm like eh okay <clears throat> shit can happen you know I can make mistakes so I don't just jump when I make videos like this I don't just jump out the window saying this is fucked up this is fucked up I do my research on it and then when I make videos like this I tend to try to ask y'all like what do you think or are you seeing it or like do you hear me do you understand what i'm saying am i tweaking you know what i mean like because i could it's very possible i could be wrong it's not common but it is possible that i'm wrong oh i seem to have miscalculated oh here we go so if you've been paying attention you've noticed that i've tried something twice and it didn't work right you know raiden's typical spin into Cy his typical storm cell into cyrax spin right now i want to pull up the game real quick I want to pull up the game real quick and just show y'all something. We'll, we'll take Raiden versus any random select character. Any random select. Ashra, cool. Wonderful. Ashra, we'll go to a stage with some light. I just want to show y'all this real quick and then we'll, then we'll get to talking. Then we'll get to talking. So, I know everybody doesn't love Raiden. I know everybody doesn't love Cyrax. But I want to learn every character in this game. And I definitely want to learn the top tiers learn what the competitive meta is in case i do compete so it's gonna help me to learn how, how to use this and how to fight this if you're wondering why i'm playing raiden when i played a bunch of other characters before but anyway a simple part of raiden's game plan especially with cyrax is block string whatever, whatever block string you choose right <clears throat> whatever block string you choose right uh, 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 it's a down back three it's a cyrax assist right cool right very very simple very very simple it does a stupid amount of chip yes i think this is dumb yes i think this should be nerfed but this is the competitive meta like this is what people are doing it's like baraka cyrax is what's in the game so the point of this video is not to say this is stupid it should go that's a totally different conversation right but that is what i'm showing you now <laughs> i'm gonna show you the exact same thing <laughs> and this is where it's just like because i know what this is i'm not new to nether not new to any of this type of stuff um, so I've, I've already seen it before um insert exclamation point before if you were my stream but um so now we have kung lao on the screen and i'm gonna try the same thing and if you don't notice it looks like he's getting pulled in a little closer or something and when i call cyrax no matter what i do he just fucking whips now at first i thought maybe i'm calling him too early Maybe I call him too late, so I'll try to call him super early. Let's try to call him super late. It, it doesn't matter. It just whips. It just fucking whips on Kung Lao. Now, I tested this. I took the time out of my fucking day to test this on literally every character in the game. Used different cameos, went to different stages just to see if there was some weird bug related to that. And it's, no, it's just Kung Lao has a weird fucked up hurt box. And where does that sound familiar from? Well, in MK11, there were a lot of characters that had weird fucked up hurt boxes. Johnny Cage had one. Joker had one sometimes. Uh, Raiden had one. <clears throat> I think Jackie had one. Like, a lot of characters just had weird smaller hurt boxes where certain things wouldn't work against them. Or they would work sometimes or wouldn't work. Or like Kano String where he doesn't spit. Like 412, uh, 41 or whatever it was, and so the spit would just whiff high over certain characters. And like eventually, after like a year or so, they patched that out. Like they they attempted to patch it out, 
Uh, they made uh, moves hit more consistently, and we had less hurt box issues. So why the fuck is that same hurt box issue in this game? Like I said, this is not about rating. I get it this into this into 14% chip. It's really fucking stupid. It should go. I agree. However, the issue is that the fucking character has a fucked up hurt box. And this is a real... How do you say? This is a serious, viable, competitive, competitive like matchup. Like, you are going to see Raiden Cyrax in tournaments. You see it all the time. You are going to see Kung Lao in tournaments. He's not the most common. But Kung Lao is a top-tier character, for those of y'all who don't know. Kung Lao is pretty fucked up. He's a really strong character. And I think if characters like Raiden get nerfed, he's going to, like, start becoming more uh, favored. Because he's got a six-frame string, right? He's got a dive kick that is... <clears throat> relatively safe right minus 11 will push back and that's all that's because he's crouching right if he's standing it's harder to get a good punish on that most characters don't have buttons that are 11 or 12 frames that go far enough to punish that type of thing he's got an armored launcher he can get good damage he's got an unreactable overhead he's got a lot of shit right 18 frames he's stupid he's a really good character so if you're playing raiden cyrax in a tournament your entire game plan just got fucking derailed just because this character is on the screen and some people are going to be like, yo, that's just a matchup. Just learn a matchup. It's not, not It's not a fucking matchup thing. There's literally no other character in the game that this happens against. So it's a fucking bug. It's not a design choice. That I, don't, don't tell me Netherrealm was like, you know what we should do? We should just give Kung Lao specifically a hurt box where certain things just whiff against him. When he's crouch blocking, just your, your general game plan is going to work against every single character. It's just going to whiff against him sometimes. And let's not tell anybody anything. Stop putting it in a move list. Let's not hint towards it anything. It's a fucking bug, bro. It's a bug. It's a glitch. It's a bug. It's a development oversight because the developers were not paying attention to the game when they were making it. And this is why we have issues like this. And <clears throat> I get it. Some people would think this is not the biggest deal in the world. But there are Kung Lao players winning tournaments, bro. And I'm not saying if you're a Kung Lao player, I'm not saying ban the character. I'm saying this shit needs to get patched the fuck out. It's stupid. Like, it ch like, what if Raiden Cyrax is the only team you know how to play? And you're really, really good. You're the best Raiden Cyrax in the world. But this is all you play. And then you run into Kung Lao, and now you just can't play your game. You got to change your entire game plan, and you're at a massive dis disadvantage because of a bug. It's just like the player one advantage thing, except that it's not universal. It only applies to one character. And there are probably other things in the game, I'm sure, that whiff the same way this does. Look, you see how that time it randomly worked? That's why I'm saying it's like, oh, it's sometimes and sometimes, but nine times out of ten it'll whiff, but every now and then it can work. I don't know the full extent of why. I mean, I just know the hurt. it's a hurt box issue because I've seen it before, right? So, again, it's just goofy, man. This game is just a fucking joke, and competitively, this game is a joke, and it's going to continue to be a joke until they fix it, and, like, this is... This is where you get into the issues of, oh, we want to wait till after the, tur after the tournament to patch it. No, sometimes there's shit you need to patch out. You need to evaluate your games. You need to pay people to test your games. You need to pay people to play your games, to find these types of bugs, to beta test. And then you need to fucking fix them <laughs> before you release the game, before you announce a pro tour, before you start running tournaments with money on the line. Make sure there's competitive integrity. Like, this is why I haven't played in a tournament. Look, at this shit is stupid. And this is just one instance. I guarantee there's other shit in the game like this. I guarantee you. Just because I haven't found it don't mean it ain't there. This is, I, I found this out in Combat League in a set that I still almost won. But, you know what I mean? Like, imagine I'm in a tournament with the hundreds of dollars, thousands of dollars on the line. The difference between first place and second place is, let's say, $1,000. You lose $1,000 because this game has a bug in it that nobody told you about you didn't know about. Nobody told me about this shit. I never, this is the first time I've ever seen it. It's just frustrating, bro. Uh, so anyway, in short, this game's a fucking joke. Um, hopefully it gets fixed one day. We'll see. I'm starting to... I'm uh, MK11 is still garbage. It's hot. That game sucks. So I'm, I'm not going to praise that game because it's terrible. But this game is not much better. Until they fix it, or if if they fix it, they don't fix this shit, it's going to go down as one of the worst fighting games ever. And one of the worst video games to release this year because it's full of bugs and issues and single player content is trash. So anyway, that's all I got for y'all today, man. I'm going to go ahead and get up out of here. Y'all stay safe. JSF, I'm out of here. Peace.